Feeling actually uh, a little bit with uh, butterflies in my bed, <laughs> like wasn't the first time. Because we you know, long time I don't, I don't, I'm not competing, so uh, I'm happy to be back. What do you think about Alistair Overeem as an opponent? You were supposed to fight him a couple times throughout the years. This is finally happening now. What do you think about him as an opponent and finally getting a chance to get in there with him? I think uh, he's, a, he's a great opponent, you know, tough fight, tough fighter, everybody knows that. And uh, he's using his kickboxing, his Dutch kickboxing his skills, you know. But uh, yeah, he likes to talk a lot, but I, I don't care too much about those things, you know. I'm focused now on the fight and we have our strategy, you know. I'm going that like the, in the first time the, the fight didn't happen because he failed in the drug test, so that was, you know, kind of strange. And now he was asking for the fight, uh, doesn't make too much sense for me <laughs> but but it's okay you know I'm a uh, why uh, doesn't it make sense for you yeah but like he was saying I didn't like to fight him you know but it doesn't make sense you know I will fight anyone I never pick pick a, a opponent you know and uh, uh, it doesn't make sense because uh, he was the guy who failed you know I was there to fight you know so it, it, it's kind of weird <laughs> as the number two in the rank today you know I see with this winning uh, on Saturday, you know, I'm going to be um, qualifying myself to, to fight for the title again. It doesn't matter who the, the, the champion is, you know. What I used to say is, I don't care about who got the belt. I, I, my, 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 my goal is the belt, you know. It doesn't matter who have him, who have that belt, you know. So, uh, or Velasquez or uh, Verdun, I'll be ready to... to after this, of course, I'll be ready to, to fight them.